In this video, we're going to take a look at your Notability backup settings. It's extremely important that you have these settings enabled within Notability so that in the event Notability becomes uninstalled, you'd be able to recover your notes from the cloud. To get started, tap the gear in the bottom left hand corner and you'll see that the very first option within the settings is to enable backup. Here at Woodward Academy, we'll use Google Drive and it'll prompt you to sign into your Google account. Always click Allow. And now you'll see that you're signed in with Google. I can select the gear to select the destination. By default, Notability will create a Notability folder within your My Drive where all of your notes will be stored. By default, the format will be PDF. You can always select a different type of backup file. So we could have a PDF. If you're constantly taking audio notes, which we'll get to later on in this lesson, you can choose PDF plus recording. The next section down is manage accounts. You'll see that you're signed into Google Drive because the button says log out rather than log in. Verify that it says log out to ensure that you are indeed signed into Google Drive. And the very last option here is iCloud. So iCloud is nice because not only will it automatically back up your files, is that it'll automatically import them as well when iCloud is turned on. When you back up with Google Drive, if you need to recover your notes, it's a manual process to import them. However, with iCloud, the export and the import is all automatic and it's done through iCloud. So I recommend also turning on iCloud. This also means that you need to be signed in with an iCloud account. If you get this message that iCloud is not available, you'll need to go into your settings and in the top left hand corner, sign into your iPad with your Woodward Apple ID. If you're unsure as to what your Apple ID is, feel free to reach out to me, robert.petito at woodward.edu, and we can get you signed in with your Apple ID. After signing into iCloud, you can verify that Notability is now enabled by selecting iCloud, scrolling down, and verifying that Notability is toggled on. With the Notability, go ahead and select iCloud to be turned on. You'll get a verification that you're now using iCloud to back up your notes. And the notes that are backed up with iCloud are editable, unlike the default settings for Google Drive with PDFs. If you were previously using Notability and you re-enable iCloud, you'll now see that all of your notes as well as how your notes are organized, automatically return to your iPad. In the next section, we'll take a look at how to modify your default notability settings. Thanks for watching.